Hi guys, and welcome to another Barb Stamps multi-card video. My video today uses the Geared Up Garage uh, bundle and suite of products. And um, so most of the cards use just these items. There are a few cards that use a couple other things, but most of them use the Geared Up Garage stamp set, the Garage Gears Thinlets, the Classic Garage Designer Series Paper, the Classic Garage Metal Elements, these adorable little wrenches and keys. Detail on those is really cute. And then the black and silver metallic ribbon. And here's the Designer Series Paper. Now I also have an online class with this bundle of products and it includes nine cards. Each card has its own video and instruction sheet, and none of those cards are going to be shown in today's video. They are exclusive to the class. The class is only $20. You can find it on my blog at barbstamps.com. Along the top, there is a little section that says online classes, and that's where you can find all of my online classes. Uh, this particular one, I also have a bundle that if you purchase my bundle of products, I'll give you the class for free. The bundle is what you see here. So if you purchase these items from me, I'll give you that class for free. So a few things about the designer series paper. These aren't all the patterns. Some of the patterns I don't have any more because I've used it all because I've really had a really a lot of fun with this paper. But something, <coughs> excuse me, about this particular pattern of paper right here is there are a bunch of gear dies in this set. So we have this large one here. And as you'll notice in the designer series paper, the gears, let's see if I can get this on here right, there we go, this large die will cut out, I think it's three of these colored gear sets, and then we have some of these smaller little gears that you can also use to cut out some of these single gears that are shown on this paper. So that's one fun thing about this particular uh, piece of the paper is you can do a lot of fun things with it. Oh, here's our little gear trio die, and you can see it'll cut that out right there. So just one of the fun things about this whole bundle of products are these dies. And now I do have a little cheat sheet for the dies here. Let me get that, show you all about that. So uh, the stamp set has a lot of images in it that have coordinating dies. So we've got the gas can, this best dad label, of course, the car, the toolbox, this large happy Father's Day emblem, the you jump stop my heart um, can all be cropped out after you stamp them. So you can see this one here. We have the best dad and then we have this fun emblem that comes in is one of the dies. And then underneath here is this little emblem here that um, you can also layer together. And then on the back side here, I just have all the gears, the separate little gears, the large one, the trio, and then the singles um, cut out of some silver uh, foil sheets, some black foil sheets, and some basic gray. So those are the dies. Lots of fun there. You can see you get 14 dies in this set. And of course, then the coordinating stamps. Here's some more of the patterns of the designer series paper. So we've got those. We've got some keys, some wheels, some gas cans, uh, the tranquil tide black and gray nuts, some tools, uh, the motorcycles and cars, which I find are really cool because a lot of the cards do uh, trim these out by hand and use them, um, which are really cool. And then these like little speedometers. And then the back sides of these are some nice patterns that you can just stamp on and use as cardstock pieces, but it's going to have a little more interest because it does have a pattern in it. So super, super cool. I showed you these. The ribbon is just like it says, silver and black metallic. So that is the Geared Up Garage Bundle. So I have 30 cards to show you today. And I'll start with a little 3D item. So actually I have 31 projects. This is a little pizza box. They're really cute. Just a layer of the designer series paper here. I think it's two and seven eighths by two and seven eighths. A gear cropped out of that fun uh, textured, well, not really textured, but it looks textured. Uh, one of the patterns of the designer series paper, the ribbon, and then the little Happy Father's Day emblem. So we've got this card here that uses the key pattern. Strips are cut out of it, laid on a layer of red. We've got the You Jump Start My Heart uh, cropped out, and then this fun little emblem here that's around it. And then we've got some silver foil sheet um, gears cut out. 
This next card is a card that I designed to kick off my online class. It's a shaker card. Look at all those fun gears. And I will link uh, that video right up here in the corner so you can check that out individually if you want to know how to make this. But we've got some silver foil sheet here and some of the gears are the silver foil sheets, black foil sheets, and some smoky slate. I've got a rectangled stitched uh, die border here that goes around the window. Of course, we've got the car colored. And then on the inside, I just have some phrases from the Itty Bitty Birthdays stamp set. So super fun. And then I just added a little key doohickey right there. These two cards I made, they're very similar. Uh, this one, I used the large gear die as an embossing piece. So you can see how that is embossed. Looks really cool. And then I just cropped out some of the smaller dies from Tranquil Tide and just glued them onto the strip. This one here, a lot faster, a lot plainer. No embossed gear, no dies, just a bunch of nuts stamped along that strip. Both have the same label with the little backing. And then the Euro Classic, this one has the wrench. And they both have the ribbon. This is a very simple one also, just some Poppy Parade. The car is colored in Poppy Parade and some Mango Melody for the headlights. The Euro Classic image stamp there, the smoke behind the car. This one here uses Smoky Slate also in basic gray as the layers behind the Designer Series paper pieces. And then we have some silver foil gears and then we have the little wrench and then Euro Classic stamped in gray on a white label. This one here uses the lined alphabet set to uh, stamp the bro. And then we have the all geared up to celebrate cropped out with the classic label punch, three different patterns of the designer series paper, just layered behind the main image there. And I don't know, oh, yep, we do have something on the inside. Um, I believe this is also from the itty bitty birthday set. And then we have the gas can there. So we've got black, red, um, and then the designer series paper. Here's a fun one that actually uses our brush o crystal color um, on watercolor paper. The car was stamped, it was wet with some spritzing water, and then you sprinkle some brush o on there and you get that fun uh, design of color. We've got the gear cropped out of silver foil, plus the gear has been the gears have been embossed in the background here of the blueberry bushel. We've got the ribbon wrapped around a silver foil sheet, and then the layer is base or smoky slate. This one starts out with a card base of Tranquil Tide. We've got this little fun kind of closure that's hooked behind that inside layer. And then just some of the designer series paper there on the front. This one uses our Friendly Expressions stamp set, which you can find in the big catalog. So we've got that. We've got a couple strips of the metallic ribbon. We've got a little car piece there with some flagged banners and Tranquil Tide and Crushed Curry. Three different patterns of the designer series paper, basic gray and black also. This one uses the tin tile embossing folder on copper foil sheets. So you emboss your layer of copper foil and then you can take some memento and a sponge dauber and then just lightly go over the raised images there and you'll get that fun dark black. Looks really aged and rustic. I really like it. The car was then stamped in Versamark and sprinkled with white embossing powder on top of it. And then uh, the A Classic, the Yore, was taken off there. This one here, we've got some basic gray as our card base. We've got a strip of Tranquil Tide and the sentiment here stamped in Versamark and then heat embossed with black embossing powder. We've got the striped embossing folder here on this little strip. We've got that mini black sequin trim, a couple patterns of the designer series paper. Happy Father's Day card here. The background of this crushed curry is our Subtles embossing folder. I'm thinking you can probably see that. We've got the smoke coming out of the back end of the car, which is on some smoky slate. The car designer series paper with black backing. Happy Father's Day stamped in Trickle Tide and then a strip of our uh, shimmer ribbon in black. Another Father's Day card here. So we've got the metallic ribbon that acts as like a covering of the seam where the designer series paper meets the layer of black. Just a simple uh, trio of gears there and then the little label there done in Trickle Tide. This card, we've got the gear image embossed in uh, the layer of gray here. The car is stamped on Tranquil Tide in black. We've got the tool pattern paper here, a uh, bit of the ribbon wrapped around, and then a little key stuck up there with a glue dot. This one uses a crushed curry card base, and then the maps etc. folder is on this layer of basic gray. We've got the uh, large gear die on both sides of that. We've got this little emblem out of silver. The You Jumpstart My Heart was done on crushed curry and then we have the steering wheel paper which I don't have any of this left I used all mine another simple card tranquil tide background gas can stamped all over this one stamped on white and cropped out with the coordinating die we've got the car here colored with gray and then the maps etc folder again on that starburst punch 
the nuts paper and the ribbon. If you're enjoying the video, give it a thumbs up. I appreciate that. It helps my channel out. And please subscribe to my channel right down here. Then you'll be notified when I upload new videos. And head to my blog at barbstamps.com for information on my online class for this bundle. This one's got a card base of Tranquil Tide, then some real red, very vanilla. Um, the car is on crushed curry stamped in black. The sentiment here um, layered on a piece of Tranquil Tide. We've got a few rhinestones and then a little gear piece up there in red. This one here, we've got the sign, the different road sign pattern paper here. We've got the metallic ribbon covering the seam. We've got the smoke pattern stamped all around this crushed curry layer. We've got gray, a large gear die here, and then the car stamped on real red and the sentiment. All right, this one, we've got a card base of basic gray, then a layer of tranquil tie, then whisper white. And then this uh, sentiment was cut out with the truly tailored, or the tailored tag punch, excuse me, a little tiny strip of the key paper, crushed curry there, and then some ribbon. This one here uses that designer series paper. So the car was actually cut out with some scissors and then Versamark ink was pressed all over it and it was embossed with clear embossing powder. So you can see how shiny that car is. Some rhinestones for headlights, super cool idea. This red paper here is the designer series paper. It's the backside of the yellow speedometer paper. So that adds a little bit of texture because the paper looks textured. This little strip also in the designer series paper stack, the rushed curry. Got the Suttles folder in the background here. I think you can see that. And then the tire pattern there on the front. Got the gears on this one cut out of black foil sheets. You can see how shiny those are. Got a gas can there stamped in red and cropped out. Uh, smoky slate and basic gray. And we've got some of that smoke images stamped back there in smoky slate. This one is done in crushed curry. We've got a crushed curry layer here with the gas can stamped all over. The sentiment stamped here on the front. A large black circle. The car stamped in black on smoky slate and then the tire tread pattern there. This one we've got real red card base, real red layer, a few different patterns of the designer series paper, another car cut out. Uh, this one's not embossed so it's just uh, a matte finish there. And then the sentiment stamped on some gray granite with uh, the end flagged a little bit. This one we've got the motorcycle cut out of the patterned paper, the gears in crushed curry, and then we've got four squares of the designer series paper uh, kind of all grouped together and then our sentiment here so black and basic gray so this one the gear is cut out of the designer series paper that i showed you at the beginning of the video uh, so is this little guy here we've got the sentiment stamped on a piece of pumpkin pie cropped out with one of our rectangle stitched framelits the background of the gray layer is the smoke and nuts stamps and then we have crushed curry as our main card base and a little bit of ribbon this one uses the duet banner punch for all these fun little flags underneath the main image here. So this was actually stamped in um, Night of Navy on Whisper White. And then I think a blender pen was kind of used to blur the ink a little bit. So that looks pretty cool. The smoke image behind the car and then all on this layer here. And then all three banners are in Poppy Parade. So we have Night of Navy, Basic Gray, and Poppy Parade. This one here, we've got some of the designer series paper on the front with the keys that kind of textured layer here, the DSP, the You Jumpstart My Heart with that fun emblem in red, the car stamped on the designer series paper and then cropped out. And then we have a little bit of the smoke image back there. And then we have some ovals and then just a little knot of the ribbon. And then we've got the white inside layer. Our final card is this card here, another one done with some brush oak crystal color. This is the moss green uh, color in that same thing. You spritz your watercolor paper, sprinkle on some brush oil, let it blend out, dry it really well, uh, stamp your car image, and then crop it out. Uh, the gears here were stamped on, or die cut from, excuse me, copper foil sheets, and then that same technique of rubbing the black ink on those raised pieces. We've got old olive, crumb cake, very vanilla. All these images are stamped in crumb cake, and then we have a little bit of our old olive twine. That's in the Occasions catalog. It's old olive linen thread, excuse me. Um, nice and thin and works perfect on this card. So that is all the cards I have for you guys today. So I hope you enjoyed this video. You can purchase your garage bundle and products in my store at shoppingwithbarb.com. And remember to check out my blog for all my online classes. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day.